It's Monday morning, we're on episode 18 of the Dare Girl Diaries and I've got a wee helper here with me too. We're just carrying on our track, what we've been on for, for the last like three weeks now, so if you've been watching my other videos you would have seen what we're up to. Um, we're on the third field, we've got one more field left which is right behind me, so hopefully we'll get well into that this week. It is a very, very big field, but it is the last one, so the end is in sight. Graham's down that end, he's back following with the Fukuchi there, and I'm just digging out. For this bit I'm going to have to dig over this fence, it's an electric fence and I do have a power cable just above my head, look at the nosy cows, um, so I'll just have to be careful digging under this bit here. All done for the day, we've done pretty well. Um, and the ground's still very gravelly, which is good. There is a little bit of sign of rock just round the corner there. Um, so, with staying close to the fence and close to the shoreline, I'm hoping that I miss it. Because the last thing I need just right now is breaking rock. But anyway, see you guys tomorrow. I'm off to the gym. It's Tuesday morning. This morning, I've just come round to post some of my merch. Um, there's very little left of my old stuff now. I'm surprised people are still actually buying it, but anyway, they are, so thank you. Um, so, yeah, I've got to go post this and then I'll jump back into the machine. That's us getting there now. Rolling out the pipe. Another 150 metres put in in between the showers because it's a terrible day today. Should really train Dipper to put this in his mouth and pull, run with it. for the day. The trench is sand at the bottom again thankfully. It was pretty serious digging along there. I know it might sound funny but um, the gravel was really hard to dig. Um, it probably doesn't help I don't have teeth in that bucket right enough. There's teeth in the Takuchi digging bucket but you know back fun with that. And he's quite a bit far eh, behind me now. I, uh, I got pretty far on today. pretty good. I don't know how many metres it is, it's from, let me see if I can point the exact tree, it's from this tree here all the way down to there. Dipper, <whistles> come here, chase the sheep. So yeah, pretty good at that. Um, I'm going to go and get a key now for dad because he broke the track dumper key. So I'm going to wait to get him a new key. Oh no. Cows are right at the pickup. Oh no, Dipper, come here, Dipper. Don't draw attention to yourself. Come here, a bit, a bit. Come here. You cocky little rascal. Oh no, but you behave yourself. We've got to try and sneak past these cows. I did ask Graham if he'd take my pickup closer to the gate before he left, but he didn't. Oh no, they're all looking at me. Don't look at me like that. <sighs> Made it. <laughs> Watch me run over the gate now. And the wee man's acting hard now that he's in the pickup. <laughs> hey! You may have seen in my clip there um, when I was digging away, I also had my YouTube video the next week watching it um, 
is I try and use good like when I'm not when I'm not doing like what's the hand to concentrate doing that track. So I like to do things while I'm doing it. I'll either watch my YouTube videos um to see what needs changed or I'll watch somebody else's videos. Today I was actually watching um how to grow your own vegetables and planters because <laughs> it's something I want to do. Um and it's quite hard going when you are sitting there just doing a monotonous job like that. And there's only so much music you can listen to then I like to get a wee bit knowledgeable and learn a little bit more about other things. So um that was my lesson for today. So yeah, let's go and get this key. Stop talking. It's Wednesday morning and again I'm on the same job as has been on for the last couple of weeks. Um, hopefully there's going to be nothing interesting to show you guys today. Hopefully don't hit any cables or burst any hoses or go through any water pipes or any other pipes and it's just a straight dig which means it's going to be boring for you guys but I really do need to get a shift on here. I'm off on Friday again for another Dara Girl. Um, one of my partnerships, I'm going with CITB down to Glasgow. So I'm really, really looking forward to that. Um, so yeah, stick with it through this boring day. Be back tomorrow and then away Friday. My radio has actually packed in on the machine. I don't know what has happened to it. I was just digging away and just kind of cut out flat. So Graham came to have a wee look to see if he could fix it, but he can't, so. You actually miss it so much. I've got my AirPods. But I just love having the music blaring, windows open, chilling out, digging away. But yeah, another good news. Um, I just had Dan on the phone there. Um, and there's a change coming to the Kubota. My my machine, this machine that I'm in, there's a massive change coming for plant works and I can't wait to share it all with you guys too. See you tomorrow. We're on Thursday morning. Um I don't know where this week's gone. It's just flying past. This morning unfortunately I've got to drive to the machine because I do need diesel in it. And this is the field. Oh <laughs> I'm going over. He's full of boulders and stumps. Thankfully I do have BF Grid Ridge tyres on the pickup which make it a little easier for doing this stuff but still it's not nice. I suppose that's what it's made for isn't it? It's an off-road <laughs> an off-road truck. So yeah same again you can probably see the track way up there. We're getting on with it pretty well to be honest. I've had people say no oh, how long is it because um these are taking ages. Um it's over a mile a 900 deep it's very long. I'm really worried actually because Graham's up here starting my machine and he's... I hope there's nothing wrong with him. Maybe he's just going to wait and help fill up with diesel or something. I hope that's why he's waiting here. We'll soon see. Oh. Morning. Morning. What are you up to? Trying to fix my radio? Yeah, I was just trying, but... There's something, there's a fuse that keeps blowing. I f*** off for that. <laughs> Have you tried another one? Eh? Do you try another one? Aye, and that keeps blowing as well. So something's blowing it? So something's shorting out. Something's not right. <laughs> what have you done to it? Oh, she's f***ing <laughs> <out. laughs> So it turns out it actually won't start? No. So it's obviously drawing power from somewhere overnight? Aye. Uh, well, there's power in the battery, so... I don't know. It's, it's coming up with a fault. Oops. What the fuck's that to? Just, just a mail. Okay. Not a cheap. It's a Kubota for you. This is the first ever issue I've had with this Kubota. <laughs> Go and take the hoochie down. <laughs> Do we what? The fuse pillars, please. Yes, boss. Oops, she's lost. <laughs> she's been 
in the track she stick. Goes, She's buggered. She's buggered, so that's the problem. So I need to go and see if we've got a spare ten in here. I'm glad you know what you're doing. I don't. <laughs> Two operators tying their hand here. Oh, yeah. Right. Go and try that, please. That's better work, get it on. Or you'll be doing double the work today. <laughs> Moment of truth. Hi. You're some boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a boy. Thank God for that. That is good quality. Here's your present. <laughs> There's plasters here too. <laughs> Ideal. In there. Just in case I get a wee shock. <laughs> Wouldn't do you any harm, Jake. <laughs> right, so fuel supply, fuel switch, airflow. Do you want to open that other side? You get in there. Starter, engine, ECU, alternator. No, I think that's all your kind of main ones. Alright, okay. But it's definitely not one in there. Don't know. Yeah? Definitely not one in there. No. That's another day over and done with. We're slowly but surely going to the end now. I'm not that far away now. You can't see now because I've walked away from the machine. Um, but I'm done, I'm going to go to the gym, take you guys with me, and then tomorrow I'm heading down to the CITB day. So a wee break from digging a trench, which will be good, I'm looking forward to it. It's Friday morning and it's 10 to 6 and I'm just heading down to Glasgow. Um, today's the day I'm going down to the CITB to do some more filming. I've got Dan coming up again. That's two Fridays in a row he's been up here. Hopefully he doesn't get sunburned this time. <laughs> and Jim and John, a videographer, are coming up to an editor. So I'll be good seeing them. I always like seeing them in person, get a good catch up. And um, I'm looking forward to the day ahead to see what is involved. So yeah, two hour drive, two hours 15. I'm stopping past um, Matrix. Scott who does my um, merch, he's also made me high vis vests and a nice jacket for today. Very last minute as usual with me. But he's um, got it there or at his office. So swing by that, grab that and then get to CITB. Um, yeah. Hopefully it's a, a clear drive down the road. So that's us arrived down at the National Construction College in Glasgow. So I'm going to go and interview some apprentices now. Why you completely ignore all of us all the time. The worst thing to do is to, to look over to us once you finish the answer. Thank you for talking to me. Is that me? Yeah, I think that's alright. Is that alright? You are going to be in the back of the shop. Oh, so, uh, yeah, just <laughs> thank you. Oh, come and, st come and stand there down over this way. Oh, yeah. So tell us a little bit about yourself. Me? Me? I don't know. Your name? Ben. <laughs> oh, that's, that's it. Hi, Ben. I'm Ben Kennedy. It's so much easier when he's like, yeah, can you just turn around? <laughs> Well, the, the coffee machines went up to 30p each. Oh, has it? It's not free anymore. <laughs> Crisis. <laughs> um, what are you doing here? Uh, I'm just sorting 
You think my coat is bad? <laughs> I love seeing all the machines like this. Look at it. KH191. How many of you guys have seen one of these or operated one of these? I think it's a bit before my time. <laughs> That's our day all over and done with with the CITB. I had such a great day. I hope you enjoyed my week. Next week's going to be 10 times better um, with one more 143 content. As always, thank you for the comments, the likes and the subscriptions. See you next week. <laughs> it's Monday morning. Morning, we are on Wednesday morning. No. Morning, we're on... <laughs> <laughs>